Hey guys, Jim from Measure Square here. Welcome to the Tile Calculation Method tutorial in the Measure Square 8 Special Topic Series. In this video, we will cover all the different approaches to calculating waste for tile, such as the default waste add-on, half reuse, cut and fit, and no reuse. To begin, let's start off with a 10 foot by 10 foot room with a 12 inch by 12 inch tile. If we right click and go in to the estimating info for the tile and set the waste add-on percentage to 10%, we will see that the quantity of the tile used changes accordingly, giving us a total of 107.86 square feet. The waste add-on percentage can be adjusted according to the product size and other factors. The important thing to remember is we are just adding a set percentage of waste over the net area of the room. The next tile calculation method is half reuse. This approach will try to take tiles that have 50% or more left and reuse them within the same room. Note, it will be helpful to go to the options menu and make sure tile cut is selected so we can see which pieces are being reused in a room. In our 10 by 10 room, we can see initially the program lays out the tile centered in the room. If we go up to the top center and select pattern position and move the product grid to create some sections where more than 50% of the tile is remaining, we can see the program will recalculate the waste and give us a visual indicator of which tiles fall into this tile calculation option. Our next tile calculation method is the cut and fit approach. This takes every available piece of the tile and tries to do a perfect cut and fit approach per room. We can see the program will display the tile cuts just outside the room with a checkerboard look, which will correspond to the checkered look smaller pieces of the tile within a room, showing the cut and fit relationship. Our last tile calculation method is the no reuse option. This approach takes the remnant of a tile and assumes it is waste regardless of how much remains to be used. For example, 75% of a tile. We can see that this approach results in a larger waste on the given product. 